For this lesson, we're going to cover alternate site redundancy. In the event of a physical disaster such as a fire or flood at your company, or a disruption of power or internet service, you'll need to plan for alternate facilities to get your company operational again. The purpose of an alternate site is to have a facility already secured and already populated with a network and server infrastructure to minimize down uh, downtime. So what is a hot site? A hot site is a facility that is ready to be operational immediately when the main company is down. All equipment and network infrastructure the company needs are already in place and can be activated quickly. The equipment duplicates the setup installed in the main company site. Hot site facility is usually provided by another company that hosts the company's equipment. Note that this solution is very expensive, but for companies that offer critical services and cannot afford any downtime, this is choice is the best. So what is a warm site? A warm site is similar to a hot site, but without most of the duplicate servers and computers that would be needed to facilitate an immediate switchover. A warm site provides an immediate facility with some minimal networking in place. Warm sites can take several days to restore and transfer data and bring the business back to full operation. This option is for companies that don't offer time critical services. A warm site is most widely used because it's cheaper compared to a hot site and it's more flexible. But the only disadvantage of a warm site is that it's not immediately available after a disaster and it isn't easily tested. What is a cold site? A cold site offers an empty facility with some basic features such as wiring and some environmental protection but no equipment. This is the least expensive option of an alternate site. If there is a disaster in the main company site, it may take several weeks before the facility and equipment are ready for operation. Note that almost all networking and server infrastructure will need to be built and configured if you use the cold site. Well, that's all I have for you. Thank you for watching.